All right, Marissa's helping today. She, we collected probably about 50 butterflies. Most of them are females, although we do have a few males as well, because obviously we want to have some males out in nature. I did this a little sooner than I was originally thinking. I was going to originally do it um, in the next couple days, but as we were in the greenhouse, we noticed that there's just so many butterflies out there. So we wanted to make for sure that we could just get them out in nature while they're still really fresh and viable and able to go do their butterfly thing. The garden, we're letting them off in right now. There's a ton of pollinator plants for them. So we're excited about that. There's a lot of Asclepias as well. So there's host plants for wherever they may choose to go. She's just kind of helping, helping them out a little bit if they're not sure of what they want to do. Some of the plants in front of us are the verbena meteor showers along with some of the play in the blue salvia. Behind her there's a bunch of tall flocks that I see that they're heading towards. funny how when freedom is so close, but yet they still cling on to comfort. I think that's true for all of us. We tend to cling to, cling to comfort when there's a whole big world around us that we yet um, are yet to explore and could just find brighter horizons if we went exploring. Thanks for watching the release today. It's been fun. Uh, continue to watch our YouTube as we continue to do more updates on the Butterfly House as well as all the many gardens we have here around Garden Crossings. Thank you for watching. This is Heidi from Garden Crossings.